What's up, YouTube? Talking about some dreams. I know Outlaw Dipper did it. A video, but... I'm doing I got some grizzly mint in my mouth right now. And it's pretty fucking good. That's all I gotta say. So, spitting in the red boa mud jug. So, if you had a dream, pursue it. You know, ever since I was little, I wanted to be in the military and I wanted to be a firefighter. When I was 16 years old, I went and got an application for the fire department and joined the Cliff Springs Fire Department. When I was 17 years old, my recruiter showed up at my house, gave me all the paperwork, said, fill it out. And then we got the parent consent. I went, maps the next week, and signed my contract for the Army. If you guys want to know what my job is, I'm a 13 Foxtrot forward observer. I call in mortars, <coughs> Ugh. airstrikes, and shit like that. I blow shit up all day. So, and yes, I really do have dip in my mouth. I got a couple messages saying, dude, do you even have dip in? Yes, I really do. Yes, dip. That's grizzly mint. I really do have it in. I wouldn't buy a $40 mud jug if I didn't. It's not just for looks like I'm really spitting in it like you know you don't get that look from beef jerky so or sawdust like Carl I put sawdust in a tin wet it down a little bit and told him it was beef jerky dip and put it in his mouth and a little bit later I was like like eight minutes later I was like Carl how's that fucking beef jerky taste he's like tastes like fucking paper so, oh, it was pretty good. But, pursue your dreams, you know? Like, Outlaw, I know you did MMA for a while, and now you want to be a WWE superstar. So, pursue it, man. I think, I think you got the potential to do it. You know? I was an MMA fighter. I got a third-degree black belt in Taekwondo and a black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. And I know UFC, like, MMA... Not really UFC, but MMA is illegal in New York. So all of my fights have been out of state. Every weekend we would drive and drive and drive. <laughs> and finally get to where we were going. And I did MMA. So if you're in New York, you can do MMA. You just got to put your mind to it. And did a lot of long rifle rifle shooting, and I have a lot of amateur shooting trophies and shit like that. My, my whole fucking thing up there is just covered in sh shooting trophies and football trophies and shit like that. So MMA is no joke, though. If you, people, are, I, a lot of people have been like, "Oh, there, you know, I ain't break a fight there. I, I, I street fight all the time. I'm like undefeated in the streets." It's like, oh, really? So I'll take him to the fucking dojo. And I'll whoop the shit out of him and make him realize it's like, this, it ain't no fucking joke. So, Taekwondo is fun as fuck, though. I'll tell you that right now. Kicking people in the head. You cannot punch people in the head. But you can kick them all you want in the face. And that shit is fun. Jiu-Jitsu is fun, but... I think it's funny you're knocking people's teeth out. I got a couple of those out there. Other people's teeth with my trophies. If I knock it out in the tournament, I'll ask them if I can have it. But it's weird, I know. But it's kind of like a little memorabilia. Like, yeah, it's not doing me any good out of out in my mouth. I can't put it back in. So, yeah, I think there's four teeth up there. And that's not going to mount when they have a mouth guard in. So. Done a couple of them. <laughs> Pretty fun. And. The military though. That ain't no joke. People are on. Duty 24-7. And. Go army. But. People are on duty 24-7. Fighting. 
for freedom and everything. So don't be hating on the troops. Firefighting ain't no joke neither. You know, you're out there fucking 90 degree day. With fucking like 20 pounds of gear on. And it doesn't let off any heat. It collects all of it. So, yeah, if you want to be a firefighter, expect some heat. Especially, unless you're, like, in Alaska where it's, like, cold all year round, basically. Then, there's going to be a little bit of warmth in your life. Especially down south. There's a couple people I know that are firefighters down south. And they say it fucking sucks. Because that heat gets to you real quick. And you can easily drop 10 pounds with just water weight. Being a firefighter. So, a lot of those wrestlers out there trying to drop weight. Ask if you can go to the firehouse and ask if you can put on some gear and just run around the fucking firehouse for a little while. You'll sweat pretty bad. So. Pursue your dreams, though. Don't let that shit get to you. If you want to be a crab fisherman, go be a crab fisherman. If you want to make dip, make dip. I don't know. Whatever you want to do, do it. There's nobody stopping you except yourself. If you tell yourself you can't do it, you can't do it. I've never told myself I can't do anything. I can do whatever I want. So that's just my little video right now. So if you dip, keep dipping your lip. Keep on spitting. Keep on pursuing your dreams, YouTube. Have yourself a good day.